Hey everybody, it's me DG Tronic. Today is Friday, June 24th, 2016, and I'm back with another Android app review video. In this video, I'm going to review an application that is extremely useful for people who are into designing floor plans, whether professionally um, or, you know, you're taking it as a course you want to practice or for fun. The app is called Stanley, uh, Stanley Floor Plan. Alright, so this is what you get right off the bat. I've already worked on something for fun a little bit, as you can see. You click on new plan, you get two different options, residential or commercial. I've done residential before. And then this is what you get. The option to start a new room on top. Or you get all these different options at the bottom. Let's start a new room. And let's choose the draw option. And I'm going to choose free form. And let's say I want it to be first floor and I want to try a dining room so I get a grid I start tapping to draw and gives you dimensions as well as you can see so let's say I know this is a weird shape, but I'm just doing it for fun. So that is going to be my room right there. Gives you all the different dimensions, as you can see. This app has a lot of different options, so I'm not going to go through it all. And I'm just going to quickly show you some of the things it does. Now I have a few options down here. Let me add a few objects. Let's say doors. Mm, I want hinged door. So I have to select a wall first. Okay, let's go back and I'm going to select a wall. I'm going to select this wall right here. I'm going to go back and recently used. I'm going to use the door. There you go put it right there. I have a few options of moving things around. Let me... Okay, that's... let's say that's done. Alright, that's done for now. Let's try to add some other things into this room. Oh, let's try some flooring. And let's say I want wood floors. This is a living room, so... Yeah, I do get that message. I don't know what that means. Well, this is a room. So I don't know why you won't be able to add it. Let's do some um, furniture then. Okay. Let's say that couch. I want to rotate it this way. And... I want to have it be there. Okay. See, sometimes it does that. I don't know why. There's an undo option. Okay. 
first floor let's go back all right this is the dining room let's try to add some other furniture there let's try to add a, an armchair let's make it that way and drag it over there yeah I don't know why these keep disappearing <laughs> okay so I hit add room and it added the furniture that's interesting let's do the couch again one more time just for the fun of it we'll put it here okay I guess that's a little glitch maybe in the application but you can see it's a lot of fun uh, you can rotate the floor any way you want um, okay let's go back to what I had worked on before let's open it this is a ground floor kitchen that I worked on before you can see the doors, the stove You can see the general shape. I have the option to edit it, to duplicate it. It's just a very cool application. A little bit glitchy at times. There's some options here. You can make an account to have your stuff saved in the cloud. It teaches you how to do a lot of stuff here. I'm not going to go through it. It is a very cool application. There's the icon, I believe the, uh, the app is called Stanley Floor Design or Stanley Flooring, I'm not sure. Too bad it doesn't say the complete name at the bottom of the app icon or in the icon. But there's the icon right there. Thank you for watching this video. Don't forget to follow me on Twitter and subscribe to my YouTube channel. They're both Digitronic. I will see you in the next video.